Hello everyone and welcome back to another daily tutorial video and today I am going to be showing you how to download and install the Go Indicator mod for Geometry Dash 2.2074. For this tutorial you do need to have Geode already installed but I will have a link to my own video showing you exactly how to download and install the Geode mod loader for Geometry Dash. So what you want to do is go over to the Geode mod loader right here and click on this download button right here. Now you want to go over to the search mods button and you want to type in the name of your mod, which in this case is go exclamation point indicator. And you have go indicator by Revter. So you just want to click on get and you want to click on this massive install button. Now you just want to wait for it to install the mod as well as any dependencies it might need. As you can see, in this specific case, we needed three mods total so that means we downloaded the mod as well as two different dependencies for example like node ids or custom keybinds so now just click on restart now and it is going to restart your game so once you're done with that you will go over to the geo mod loader button again and you can see the editor level id api and node ids as well as the go indicator itself so here you can just click on view and you have a bunch of different things you can look at. You can look at the crediting right here, the license. And here it says, this mod allows you to add custom indicators to your progress bar. You can set percentage, color, and text for each indicator. Settings are stored separately for each level, so you can have different indicators for each one. You can use slash n to add new lines and text. So now if we go over to, for example, a level like Stereo Madness. And here we go to the percentage. Here we can see everything so we can select the percentage for example i don't know at 10 percent or something let me just go ahead and type it in text form just like that and click x here if i actually enable the progress bar because i usually play without it you can see there's a go indicator at 10 percent so if we get to 10 percent in the level we will actually see that we pass the go indicator so it basically allows the people in the chat to see if you're doing well on a level or not. This is very useful for like streamers and content creators where you're going to be putting in hundreds of hours into a level and you know you're gonna have your, your go thing or well you getting farther into the level get counted differently the longer you play the level for example at the start it might be like 50% and you might move it over to like 70% as you get better and more consistent at the earlier parts. And doing it inside of the game is way more intuitive than having to change your YouTube title each time that you actually do a stream. So this is something you can change multiple times on stream without having to wait for any weird Google index or YouTube indexing issues on the old stream title. So yeah, it's very useful. Anyways, that is how to download and install the Go Indicator mod for Geometry Dash. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications and I'll be seeing you in the next one. Peace. Did you enjoy that video and want to support the channel? Well, now you can with our $1 membership tier. As a channel member, you'll get a shout out in every long form video I make, just like this one. You will get early access to new long form videos, sometimes days and even weeks in advance. You'll be able to vote on video topics every once in a while, and you get some cool badges and new emojis as well. If you found any of that interesting, go check out the top link in the description for the full list of perks because I did not list everything, and yes, there is more. This is the highest value for the dollar membership on the platform.